Hey, hey, all you crafty people. We are here and fixing to do our last. Let me just remind you, these were our paper clip on thingies. And we've got these little tags that pop out. And I wanted to show you if it's a little tight, which mine are, I'm going to take, now this is a, you know, a metal ruler. And I'm just going to run it up along where that glue is. I'm not trying to open it all the way, so, you know, don't, just be careful. I mean, you can re-glue it if you open it all the way, but it's just like there was too much glue grabbed a hold. Now let's see how much better this is to slide in here because this is just a you know medium very actually not much of a cardstock at all so there yeah it did make it a lot easier so that's just a you know just a a little tip or hint there and then we've got this enjoy remember I wanted one to be able to go this way and one to be able to go this way um, or vice versa uh, and um, so those, and then we've got this bad boy, which it looks great from the front and the back, and you slide your paper in between to get into the paper clip. So you have that on that side and that on that side. I love these. These are so much fun. Um, so now I have one final paper clip, and I have attached a little bead dangle. <laughs> Whoops! and a large um, kind of a kind of a fancy jump ring with with one of my keys um, I am thinking I want to try and do a little something something with the key but I'm just not really sure what so I, that might wait if I end up doing anything I think I will wait until I get where I'm gonna put it and see if I if I can leave it the way it is or if I need to change it. Okay, so um, I have decided that I want to use this um, tag from the uh, from the digital kit, which I'm using Dreams Etc. Collaged Rose. I had a gal ask me the other day, and um, so I thought I would make sure that I said that this time because I know I have it in my description box, but I haven't been saying it. So not everybody reads those description boxes or even know that they're there. Um, so I've got a piece of, uh, you know, chipboard that you get in the mail. Let's use that stuff up, right? And I'm just wanting to glue. I don't really even need all of this. I just want to glue a piece that's going to be large, large enough for this. So that ought to do me right there. Let's just get some glue. and get this bad boy. This is going to decorate the back of the um, the back of the tag because you do see the back of it. So there is that. Let's make sure we get that glue all around. Okay, and let's see. I think this will go through everything. I want to cut off that white. Yeah, okay. I keep these from the mail all the time. They are great for bits of chipboard and things like that that you need, you know, um, to do stuff with. You need it to do stuff with it. You know what I'm saying? And that left a little bit more white than I want, which is none. So we'll do that. And we'll throw these away. And we'll come over here. And I'm just going to 
cut that off. Put that back in our scraps. Okay, so there is the back part. Now, if you have an up or down, make sure you have the top on your top. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? You feel me, people? <laughs> all right, all right. I'm sorry. I know I act like I'm yelling at you, but I'm not. I'm just... It's a gorgeous day. I took the dogs for a walk already. My husband is out of the house doing yard things and mowing and it's like spring has sprung finally finally I'm still wearing long sleeves because it's kind of chilly in the house uh, but you you go outside and I'm comfortable in the shade but I am warm when I get out in the sun so it's kind of a nice feeling it's been a long time babies long time all right, and some of you I feel for you're still you're still in it, and then others you've had it for a while. So <laughs> I like being there in the middle, though. Okay, so now you're going to figure out. You know, this has got kind of a wavy uh, line, which which I kind of like. So I think I'm going to kind of try and keep all of this. And just cut around. Now we are going to have to do something about the um, the edge because you know it's it's almost a piece of chipboard now. So you do have uh, a a thicker edge that is definitely going to be white. So. Um, you know, are you going to want to leave it white? Are you going to want to make it a color? That's just, you know, it's not it's not a huge problem. And I don't mean for it to sound like it is. But, you know, it is something that you'll want to think about. Because I tend to worry about all the little things. <laughs> it's, just, it's just what I do. And I'm sorry if you guys find that boring. Uh... I, I, you know, I am what I am, and I do what I do, and if you like it, you'll stay with me. If you don't, you won't, and so I hope you do, but I understand. I can be, uh, very repetitive. Whew, I know that. Um, I take after my father. We take the clock apart rest his soul I, I I am speaking of him and myself in, in maybe not a great light but uh, yeah he in order to answer your question he would take the clock apart and put it back together again and and by that time you hopefully got what the answer was oh. And I hated it when he did it because it's like just say yes or no or blah or it's you know it, it, he could never do that. But I really understood it by the time he answered the question. You know, I understood it better anyway. <laughs> I might not have been happy that I had to wait that long. But you know what I'm saying. <laughs> Okay, so I want this to go on the largest part of the paper clip. And let's see, actually, let's move everything this way. Okay, so here is the long part of the paper clip, and here is the short part of the paper clip, you know, with the, the shorter piece gonna see now let's keep this in the longest part now I I want to pull that out 
and glue this on, but I want to put something across the back that's really going to help it uh, stay that way. So, what can we put across the back that's going to help it stay that way? Well, I do have some cut flowers. Uh, let's see. If I did... I hate covering all that pretty up that's on the back of this. So that that's too large. Let's see, what else do we have? Oh, we have our little round little round jobbies. We can look at those. I don't have a whole butterfly that I could use. Um I have another word here. Let's see, I have journey. That's cute. I could put that on a nicer bit. That's uh, nicer meaning a little thicker because this is just copy paper. So let's look at doing something with this. I need a little more substantial than that. Um... Let's see. Well, we could use the same little piece we already used. And I'm, I don't have to worry about uh, the back because uh, it's not going to show. And this would give me enough sub substance to really help hold this paper clip on with all of the things that you do, you know, on and off and on and off, such as that. So, let's... I'm going to glue it all on and then I'm going to cut it because it, it's not it's not cut very nicely. Let's try and find a spot where it's not going to show anything through. All right. First I'm going to cut it just kind of where the paper is and then I'll take a uh, 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 a better look at how I can cut it to make it look nicer. Let's see. You go back over there. All right. So... Okay, throw away and back into my little stash there. So I have this. Let's go along. Okay, so there's that. And we're going to... And then let's do there. Okay, that's pretty good right there. Yeah, that looks very nice. All right, now I think I'm going to use my E6000. And I want to glue... Oh, I lost my key. Uh-oh. There it is. Okay, so I am going to put some E6000. Okay, let's do it a different way. Um... 
I'll use a little bit of my spatula here. This is some old stuff. Let's squeeze some new things out of there. That's some old stuff. Okay. Here we go. Okay. I don't know. That is still not what I'm used to playing around with. Um, let me get a wipe and squeeze some of this out. I've had this for a while, but I keep it I keep it closed up. So let's see what we got here. I don't think that stuff's any good. So, let's put this right in there. I don't want to break that. Stuff up at the top because I don't want to not be able to put my stuff, my uh, articles that I'm trying to get in. So I'm sorry, I know I was off screen. I ended up with a bunch right around the top and I don't really want to get it too much on the top because I don't want to not be able to get things up into the paper clip. And I am leaving this part bent up, see, bent up, so that it doesn't get into the glue. Now, I'm going to put a little bit on the ends. And down the center. Oh, oh, let's get my tweezers before I glue myself together here. <laughs> okay, and let's get this across. Okay, let me do this down towards the bottom. Actually, let me lift this back up. Not, not dry yet. And I'm going to scrape off because I got way too much. Where's my All right, so let's do this piece all the way up and get that. And now let's do journey. the lid back on this. All right. That E6000 stuff is stinky. But gotta love it. Okay. Make sure I get all of that off of my spatula here. I'll get some gooby gone on it in a little while. Okay. There is that. 
now I can bring that paper clip back down a little bit. So then there is my other top paper clip. So they look beautiful from front and back so they will decorate both sides of the pages. And then this goes on to a right-sided page and this one goes on to a left-sided page. Love it. I will do uh, the other set for the other book and come back and show you those. If I do anything different, I will come back and show you what I did differently. All right, guys. Love you much. Talk to you later. Bye.